the January Ultimate Membership Box is here. And inside it seems like we got ourselves a cuter version of Buzzra, along with a Star Buddy. Yep, nearly the end of January, and many of you guys know, it's also almost time for this month's Ultimate Membership Box. And won't you know, when I logged in and checked my mailbox, boom, what a pop, boom, pow, right there, we have ourselves your January Ultimate Membership Box is here. And inside it seems like we got ourselves a cuter version of Buzzra, along with a Star Buddy, yep. A buddy that a star that literally wearing sunglasses with a smile leaving a rainbow comet trail behind it. But mainly I'm more interested about that cute water type buzzer. I think it would have a water type attribute. I know it wouldn't be unreasonable. But over here it says ramp up your prodigy adventures with these ultra rare and fantastic member only items from this season's ultimate membership box. Check back next season for more exciting items, and you can do that, but let's open our membership box and see what we get. Now why am I surprised that both of them have like the member star above it? It's given the news that we got ourselves is Storm Bluff and... and Glitter Star. So we literally got this star in front of which we added Glitter and Storm Bluff. Okay, now I'm more interested about Storm Bluff, like what type of monster is this? What does it do? You know, like, what are its attributes? What can it do? What can't it do? Let's see. Alright, this is our pet book over here. Let's go to your team. At the very end, we have ourselves Storm Bluff. Ah, uh, yes, let's upgrade it to level 13. Alright, Storm Bluff over here it seems to be an Electro-type. It looks exactly like the Nebula, I believe. No, not Nebula. It looks exactly like the Owl. Anyways, let's learn to spell, and we can see its stats. From where we see it looks okay, let's go to our pet book and check upon it. On the 24th page. Right here we find ourselves Storm Bluff, right? It says, Storm Bluffs are darker colored versions of Nebula. What? Yeah, okay. okay. I said it looked like Nebula and I am correct, right? Nebula that are Nebula that like to remain hidden. They sometimes can be found playing playing in the rain on stormy days. So it basically seems to be a Nebula or oh, Nebula has buff at the end and bluff. Storm Bluff has bluff at the end. How did I not realize this? This is absurd. I was going on saying how it looks like, uh, what do you call it? Froza, or Buzzra, or like any of the other mythical epics you can find lying around over here in the back, right? Like here, Buzzra. Look at this dude. You guys get what I'm saying? So yeah, this seems to be the new mythical epic. So let's just quickly toss it onto our team and see how it does. And now another thing which we did get, I am assuming is the buddy, would be in our inventory over here. Yes. Excellent. And if you go to buddies at the very top, you can see Glitter Star, a shooting star which seems to accelerate itself forward by potting out rainbows with a few sparkly fumes. And you know, I guess it does look pretty good. I guess you could say a little cute. And it says, This shooting star just too cool. Alright, and what it says is, This shooting star is just too cool for outer space. Alright, so now you have something which is burning over a million degrees chasing you. Yep. Totally not terrifying, totally not burning everyone around you to crisp, but that is a shooting star chasing right after your wizard. But your wizard better keep running, or they're about to get sent to the next world. Or realm. I don't know. But yeah, let's test out our monster in a quick battle. Right, so since it's storm, let's go ahead and fight some water type monsters. Hopefully water type monsters, you know? I don't want to have Storm and end up fighting an ice type opponent or something like that. That would not be too fun. Come on. Yes, okay, water type opponent. Let's see how it does. Ooh, two water type opponents. That's quite nice. Uh, then that was. Uh, 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 oh, okay. Well, I guess we're fighting Electro with Electro. Please don't die right now, Mr. Bird. If someone kill I. Thank you. Thank you for not hitting my bird. Right, so let's just quickly cast an Electro spell around here. You know, anyone can be the target. I really don't care. As long as we get to see Storm Bluff in action, I will be happy, okay? Just eliminate one opponent, you know. Just gotta make sure that Enchant Storm Bluff doesn't get attacked. Increase its survivability. Oh, okay. Three spells. It seems to have a healing spell. That's either a self-healing spell or a teammate healing spell. And two Electro spells, which is not too bad. Alright, let's see. Alright, so we can heal, replenish, and it can only heal itself, okay? That's that's good, you know, like if our Storm Bluff is pretty healthy, you can do that. Then we have ourselves Spark Sphere and Storm Glow, which is not too bad. 
A storm group does have a cooldown, but so far this monster looks pretty strong. I mean, compared to its health, it did a decent amount of its damage, like one fourth of its health in damage to the opponent, you know? So it looks like it has potential. Of course, if it was at level 100, it would be able to deal far more damage, but right now it's not. So it can't. But yeah, that seems to be all with today's Prodigy update. They seem to have just launched the Ultimate Membership Box in game. And if you guys ask me, it's pretty good. Like, like yes, we did get a new, better looking pet. Wait, wait, wait. Have we done a Stormbrook vs. Nebula comparison? Let's see. Let's see what happens if we put them on the same team. Well, in reality, I know my wizard will have to do most of the work and fix everything, but still, you know, Valiant's efforts, my wizard, I fix. And with that, we can confidently say that our opponents have been defeated and they have been sent to the birdie realm, where all birds go after being deleted. And once you look at that, this level has risen nearly twice over. And let's open that number chest, see what we get. Oh no, it's not bad. So right guys, I think that's gonna be all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Found out that the membership was out membership box was out and found out the interesting pet no found out the interesting pet but that was inside of it. And if you did, do make sure to demolish that subscribe button, give this video a humongous thumbs up. I'll catch you all next time. One Dr. Genius out the house. Thank you for watching and bye.